Dogs bark for various reasons. It could be because they are excited, frightened, surprised, or irritated. Small dogs make amazing pets, especially when you live in a small space. But small dogs have the character of being yappy and barking a bit too much. It can also pose a problem if done excessively. If you live in a small apartment, this can become an issue not just for you, but for your neighbors. In today's video, we will be covering the top 10 small dog breeds that don't bark much. Make sure to stick around to the end of the video where we will reveal to you the top 10 small dog breeds that don't bark much. Hello everyone, welcome to Dog Oracle. Before we get started with the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more great daily doggy content and to help us grow. Make sure you stick around to the end of the video where we reveal our number one dog that's so silent that you will never actually hear it bark. Let's get right into it! Number 10. French Bulldogs French Bulldogs are happy apartment occupants and they are known to rarely make any noise and don't need much exercise other than brisk walks. The Frenchie, as it's commonly called, is playful, alert, adaptable, and completely irresistible. Frenchies don't bark much, but their alertness makes them excellent watchers. Their playful nature doesn't manifest in barking either. They don't bark frequently, although they may be exceptions to the rule. They make good pets and are also good companions. They make wonderful household pets with amazing personalities and have good relationships with children and also other pets. They also enjoy and cherish contact with humans, and since they don't bark much, whenever they do bark, something must really have caught their attention, making them good watchful small dogs. Number 9. Shiba Inu The Shiba Inu is a good-natured breed and are normally quiet dogs, making them ideal for apartment living. They are sturdy, muscular dogs with a bold, confident personality to match. Although they don't bark much, they can be quite vocal with a variety of vocal stylings. One of its various vocal stylings is the Shiba Scream. It's a high-pitched scream that can make one's body hair stand. They do this when either experiencing fear, anxiety, or just a general displeasure. The Shiba Inu is a good family dog, loyal and devoted, and does well with children if properly socialized. They make wonderful household pets with less noise. They can be stubborn and hard to train, but they are good companions. Number 8. Papillon Papillons, also called the Continental Toy Spaniel, are generally outgoing and happy dogs that enjoy sitting in laps as much as they like running around the house. They are quite lively and energetic, but they do not bark excessively. Papillons are not typically known as a barking breed, but when they are left at home all day alone, they can bark and whine for hours. But it's not in their nature to bark a lot, and they make good apartment pets that rarely disturb the neighbors. Papillons have always been bred to be companion dogs and are used to being around people so they would make perfect pets for dog owners looking for small, quiet dogs. Number 7. Cavalier King Charles Spaniel The Cavalier King Charles Spaniel, unlike the Basenji, does have normal bark, but they don't bark much. It does not bark much due to its docile nature. This breed was a favorite of British aristocrats. They are gentle yet athletic. They are absolutely adorable and, of course, rarely make a peep. They are easygoing dogs by nature and most owners agree that they tend not to bark a lot. They usually bark if they're excited, because they are dogs after all, but they don't bark much because it's not their nature to do so. The Cavalier King Charles Spaniel is affectionate and easygoing, making friends with new people. The Spaniel is superb with children and a pleasurable companion. Number 6. Italian Greyhound the Italian Greyhound is gentle and sweet-tempered and makes a great, quiet, and good companion dog. They don't just yap like every other small dog, and it's a normal dog bark. Italian Greyhounds are moderate barkers. They don't bark much. They may bark to give warning to their owners or simply to try to get your attention. 
They may also bark if they are experiencing separation anxiety when being left alone for long periods. They are, however, not heavy barkers but rather decorative couch dogs who are rather lazy. Or it might be that they don't bark much because they are polite and peaceful with everyone. They are also generally compatible with children. Number 5. Pug Pug is a breed of toy dog that originated from China and is known as the breed that knows no violence. Pug's tendency to bark and howl is low, which makes them a quiet breed. Having a low tendency to bark doesn't mean pugs aren't vocal. Apart from an occasional warning or playful bark, pugs make other noises like snorts, squeaks, and grunts. Pugs are the ideal house dog and are happy in the city or country with kids or old folks. The pug is a valued companion dog who rarely barks much, and because they don't bark much, they are the ideal apartment dogs and make good roommates. Pugs aren't yappy dogs, but what they lack in yapping, they make up for in other sounds like wheezing and snoring. Pugs bark when happy to get your attention when they are left alone or endangered. Number 4. Japanese Chin Japanese Chin, also known as the Japanese Spaniel, is a lab dog and a companion dog perfect for apartments. They are known for their protruding strabismus eyes or eyes that don't look exactly in the same direction. This bright and amusing lab dog is graceful and generally quiet. Japanese Chin do not bark a lot. They are known to be great in condos or apartments because they keep their thoughts to themselves. Japanese Chin were bred to be companion dogs and they make the perfect roommates. They are very playful and affectionate dogs. They also make good watchdogs even though they don't bark much. Since they are a playful breed, the Japanese Chin will join you in singing and they are quite vocal even though they rarely bark. And they enjoy dancing, their popular dance is the chin spin. Number 3. Bolognese the Bolognese is the main choice for anyone in need of one of the quietest dog breeds that doesn't bark too much, which is perfect for apartments as they would rarely disturb the neighbors. Almost nothing can disturb their quietness, and they love being part of a family. They may be a small breed, but they do not have a small dog yappy bark. The Bolognese have a deeper sound when barking, though they are not known to be big barkers. They bark occasionally when they feel lonely or need attention or are worried about something that they are not familiar with. They form close relationships with their owners, can be quite playful, and also get along well with other animals. Number 2. Whippet Whippets are not known to be a vocal breed and some hardly even bark at all. They are gentle, patient, and quiet companions. They rarely make much noise and they never, or at least, rarely bark. They are perfect for apartment dwellers who want pet dogs that don't disturb their neighbors. Whippets and cats don't see eye to eye sometimes and this can make them bark. They may also bark from time to time as a means of communicating with us and their fellow dogs. Whippets may also bark with joy when a member of the family returns home from work. They get really excited and will let out a bark. Whippets are also known as Velcro dogs as they tend to stick really close to their owners. They make good, quiet pets. Number 1. Basenji And to our number one dog, the famous Basenji dog that is so silent you hardly hear it. Basenji is nicknamed the barkless dog owing to the breed's unusual shaped larynx. This handsome hunting dog originates from Africa. They are known for their tendency to make little to no noise. This doesn't mean they don't make noise, and they are rather quite vocal and produce an unusual yodel-like sound. The ventricle of the larynx is more shallow in the Basenji and is believed to limit the ability of the vocal folds to vibrate sufficiently enough to make a bark. Some believe the ability to bark was purposely bred out to avoid attracting predators to villages. Others think it is a naturally evolved trait that developed over time. The fact that Basenji don't bark is thought to be the reason why the dog survived its semi-wild existence and proved them useful to African hunters. They are clever dogs 
and make great pets and don't actually bark. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let us know your favorite dog on the list by commenting below. Or if you missed any dog you think should be on the list, let us know in the comments. Be sure to like and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy these videos. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video.